Ah, tem uns caras aqui. Você tem autorização para estar aqui? Saga Anderson. Are you two supposed to be here? I'm Ilmo Koskela. Fantastic to meet you. And yes, Stephen here hired me to show him through the woods. He's in town on important government business. Fixing this impressive piece of hardware. I work for the FBC, ma'am. I'm authorized to be here. And I bet you two are here about that murder. Nasty stuff. How's it going? How did you hear about the murder, Ilmo? Do you know anything that could help us? People tend to tell me things. The Koskala brothers are kind of a household name around here. Speaking of, uh, if you're looking for some fun, stop by Watery. Just down the road from Bright Falls, there's our Coffee World Amusement Park. There's sauna, sauna ya vista. <laughs> and we offer a variety of guided tours, hunting, fishing, hiking, whatever strikes your fancy. You name it, we probably got it. What is this thing? It's just a monitoring station, ma'am. The Federal Bureau of Control checks volcanic activity and air toxicity levels. No need to worry, though. It's mostly for research purposes. That's one gorgeous wetter saga. <laughs> Looks Nordic. I bet a family member made it. Stephen, we're investigating a murder that occurred nearby. What can you tell me about your bureau? Nothing that isn't classified, I'm afraid. But I don't know anything about a murder. The operations here are run by a different department. I'm just here to make some repairs. The wiring on this thing frays every couple months. Yep, that's the raccoons. They grow real big here with teeth like you wouldn't believe. Can not run through a garbage can. My mother made this sweater for me. How do you know? I knew it. My mom used to knit those sweaters for me and my brother. Watery, my hometown, was founded by Finnish immigrants. So between your name and the sweater, I figured your family might be from Finland too. Suomi, Finland. Ulla, Karjalan piirakka. Close. My mom's family is from Sweden originally. I don't know much about them beyond that. The sweater is just something to remember her by. Thank you. I need to head out. What the hell is this? What'd you find there, Stephen? Uh, nothing. Just something that shouldn't be here. Pô, esses caras estranhos, cara. Esses caras tá é muito estranho. Ali eu já abri, né? Então, beleza. É, vamos lá. Deixa eu ver aqui. Oh, não é aqui não, eu quero ver o mapa. É, agora eu vou dar a volta aqui. E subir aqui no local do crime. Que tem dois pontos de interesse. Let's get to the murder site, Casey. Esse cara é meio estranho. Hein? A lot of things about this case keep bothering me. But one thing feels really off. Breaker's disappearance. I don't get the feeling Nightingale was responsible. Hmm, he was about to give you more of those pages. Something didn't want us to have them? Or was protecting him from Nightingale? Spontaneous combustion? I don't know. I, not the kind of disappearance we normally solve. É, será que o gordão aí ele tá por trás de todos os assassinatos, véi? Deixa eu ver aqui. Ó, passamos o portão, ó. Não dá pra marcar? Temos ponto de interesse aqui na frente, ó. Our crime scene's drowning. I never mind if it rained. 
feels like home. No sign of Nightingale. But the page did place him at Cauldron Lake, in an overlap. So how do we follow him there? Maybe something around here will tell us. Ver se eu consigo... Ó, tem ponto de interesse aqui. Ver se eu consigo entrar. Vou dar a volta, ver se eu consigo entrar pelo outro lado. Bare feet. Nightingale. I'll see where these footprints lead. Can you come through the crime scene one more time, KC? Just in case? On it. If anything comes up, I'll radio you. Algo escureceu do nada, Ai, caramba, aqui é onde que eu tava, velho. Ponto de interesses. Hey, Casey. What's the forest's favorite shape? A triangle. I don't get it. Yes, you do. Ele fala que é ponto de interesse, mas só que não. Ó, oh, aqui dentro tem um ponto de interesse. Alguma coisa a gente não tá conseguindo ver aqui, velho. Será que é aqui atrás? Alguma coisa a gente tá travado aqui, velho. Flashbacks. 
Sure. The North Side Slasher. But that case was completely different. The trees, Anderson. He hid the bodies in the forest. Did you know this entire area is inside a caldera? This whole mountain used to be an active volcano. Imagine the force it took to carve this crater out of the earth. Calderas are pretty rare, so be sure to take it in. So, essentially, we're standing in the gaping maw of hell. You got it. I used to love geology when I was in school. I helped Logan build a great baking soda volcano for her science fair. Cheating on a science fair? That's almost a crime, Anderson. I'm not gonna say no to quality time with a volcano. I mean, my daughter. We've seen this symbol before. Hmm. Good eye. After we find Nightingale, what then? I've never arrested a monster. I've watched you arrest plenty of monsters, Anderson. You know what I mean. Monster monsters. Light worked against him at the morgue. That might be the only way to stop him from hurting anyone else. Monsters? Overlaps? Rituals? What do you make of all of this? Mm -hmm. The killers are usually the ones performing the ritual, not the detective. Acting out their sick fantasy. They may be trying to get you involved. Forcing you into their twisted world. But with dead men coming alive... The word ritual starts to have more weight behind it. We need to look around, learn what this ritual is.
team, KC. Okay. So, where do I get her? Get her a book. Something weird and dark. Maybe that'll get her back into reading. Maybe I should call David, see how Logan's doing. They're fine, Anderson. What's got you so worried? I just feel bad being gone so long. I've never taken a case this far from them. Ah, uh, they can manage without you for a few days. There's another lunchbox. The tracks lead into the water. Where'd you go from here? I can feel something. <laughs> 